So this question is a diagram question. We have a table here, x and f of x. Uh, we have these ordered pairs that are provided here um, for x is 0, 1, and 2. And then the question goes on to say for the linear function, the table shows three values of x and their corresponding values of f of x. Which equation defines f of x? So anytime I see the term linear function or linear equation, I'm thinking of slope-intercept form of a line. In function form, that would be f of x is equal to mx plus b. Of course, we could also write it as y equals mx plus b. You just have to remember that y and f of x are the exact same thing. So let's see what we're given. We're given that when x is 0, y or f of x is 29, that actually tells me the y-intercept, which, of course, is our b value. Don't forget, b represents the y-intercept, and m represents the slope. So since I know that my b value is 29, I can rewrite this as f of x equals m x plus 29. That gets me in the right direction. And I can also go to my answer choices and say that for that reason, B is gone because I have a plus 32, not a plus 29. And so is D because I have a plus 35 instead of a plus 29. All that's left now is to figure out my slope. So how do we find slope? So slope is easiest found by finding the difference between our x values and the difference between two, I'm sorry, between the difference between two y values over the difference between two x values. I'm going to choose these two ordered pairs. So, for instance, here, this would be x1 and y1. This would be x2 and y2. So, to plug those numbers in, y2 is 35, y1 is 32, x2 is 2, y1 is 1, 35 minus 32 is 3. 2 minus 1 is 1, and therefore my slope, my m value, is equal to 3. So now, again, I have my full equation, f of x is equal to 3x, right, because I just found that m is equal to 3, plus 29, that the question gave me by telling me that when x is 0, f of x is 29. So there is my equation, and therefore the correct answer here is choice A.